Welcome back to Ballistic High Speed. We've got two finale episodes for you guys. We're wrapping up our week here at Washington County Machine Guns. And as you can see, we've got a little army of ballistic torsos, wonderfully provided by Ballistic Dummy Lab. Chris is here as well, so he'll get to see the destruction. And what are we gonna be doing to these? Today, we have a military grade Claymore. This is an M18A1 anti-personnel mine. This is not a fake, a phony, this is not a prop. This is military spec, 1.5 pounds of PETN. This actually is a little bit over at 1.55 okay. pounds. A little bit more spicy. A Little bit spicier, and it comes with a little extra punch. They typically have 700 of those steel ball bearings. Yeah. They're like, kind of think of it like a BB. We filled it a little bit more than that. Yeah, this one's probably pushing 1,200. Yeah, we jam packed that thing. So it's gonna be- Probably about eight feet away eight, 10 feet away. Yep. This guy here should get the brunt of it. He should probably go away. And these two got kind of a, a cone of destruction. So we'll see how much these two get. They should get at least the blast, maybe some of the pellets, but this is gonna be pretty insane. So like I keep saying, if you haven't subscribed yet, you're gonna wanna do it now because the next episode is gonna be an even bigger explosive. Yep. So just double touch on it. We're at Washington County Machine Gun. Yep. And this is real PETN. Let's get this set up and see some of the best high speed I think we're ever gonna see. Let's do it. All right. So our Claymore here is aimed pretty well just, we're kind of focused on this guy right in his chest. The blast radius should cover up, down, over into these guys. Should just be a, a madhouse in here. Yeah. And so to make sure we get even more extra safe and keep our cameras usable so we can get you guys more content, Tread has this, I believe this is out of a uh, Humvee actually. It's one of the armored windows. It's going to protect anything from going any direction towards us and keep it all going towards the dummies. Yep. And we're going to be about probably at least 400 feet away around oh, the corner. Yeah. And this is going to be set off with electrical detonators so we can do it nice and safely. Yep. And yeah, there's not much more to say. Yeah, that's we pretty much it. just got to see what happens. It's about time to get to it. Go. All right. Tell them we're ready, ready. High speed ready. Three, two. The middle one's gone. There's okay. three triggers. Nobody move. All right, nobody move! What'd you guys think of that sound blast? Uh, very loud. Pretty intense. Well, Tread nailed the distance on how far that would go. So. That took a lot of energy. Yeah. Okay, center guy, <laughs> his head is gone. This guy has wood lodged into him. Oh God. The Claymore was on a pallet and there's no longer a pallet. Oh. There used to be a pallet there. So like all that dirt got shot into these guys, man. Yeah, that's, that's like three or four inches down into the earth. Uh, there's a super clear BB going oh. straight through. You can see it through his shoulder out the other side. That's perfect. Wait. He had a head, right? This dude had a head. Look at the top of his <gasps> skull. <laughs> Holy crap. And there's his brains or something. There's blood all over the head. <laughs> oh, yeah, there's blood pieces, everywhere. Pieces of brain. Wait, wait, what do you think about that? <laughs> That's pretty nasty. And look at all the bones coming out, his ribs. Completely his charred. Spine. Charred, dude. Yeah. And this actually happened to people in combat? Ugh. Oh, all over Vietnam. Jesus. Good Lord. All those black dots are BBs. The ribs are completely gone. The whole front of the rib cage is gone. Oh, you're right. I, oh, yeah. I don't even know where it went. I think I found the head. <laughs> oh, Tread found the or head. What's left of it? <laughs> is there any? Wait, is that the? Oh yeah. <laughs> I guess it's like that. Is that right? That's his brain. <laughs> well, Tread, you've done claymores before. Is this what you expected, or more devastating? No, this is what I expected. Yeah. Yeah. That's awesome. pretty typical. Bloop. Oh, oh, interesting. Oh, look at all of them yeah. floating. It's no wonder it sent him so far, because when bullets stop in your body, all the energy is deposited. I don't know where it glue the top of his rib cage yeah. to. There's so many in there. Oh, those are steel. He'd be fine. He wouldn't get lead poisoning or anything. You know what would be really awesome to do with this right now? Go huck it into an MRI machine. Oh, I just <laughs> have to go slow mo. <laughs> just watch them all come ripping out. Okay, well, uh, what about the other guy? Yeah, I don't see much from the back. 
Oh, yeah, oh. He, he caught some. Yeah, he's collapsing along. Tension pneumothorax. Tons of channels. The BB is stuck against the clavicle here. Oh, yeah. So one dude's for sure dead. The second dude is also probably dead. Oh, that headshot. This dude, he's iffy. Both his, both his lungs are gone. This one's dead center, like right through his sternum here. That's getting pretty close to the heart. Well, heart's a little more over here, but damn. Yeah, I don't know. He might be okay if he's rolling with a real good medic, maybe. <laughs> I don't know. That's, any combat medics in the comments? No? Could you fix this dude? All those black dots are BB penetrations. Yeah, there's a BB right there. And his chin. His chin. <laughs> okay, so he was right on the edge of that destruction cone. None of us have ever seen claymores in slow-mo before. You guys want to go check it out? Oh, absolutely. This has got to be <laughs> unprecedented. <laughs> before we get into the high speed, we want to thank Tread Barton, the owner of Washington County Machine Guns, which is the largest machine gun rental company east side of the Mississippi and the only place in America where common citizens can work with high explosives. Outside of their machine guns, they also have a really big inventory of really cool stuff. They have a bunch of high explosives. There's grenades, they have a marine flamethrower, and they just got an RPG-7 with actual military rockets for it. Gonna have to go back for that one. Absolutely. <laughs> yeah. Tread's company donated all of the explosives and expertise needed to make an awesome killer series of videos. So we can't thank him enough. So if you guys want to thank him, head to his YouTube channel and website description below. You can find those links. Check out his stuff. He makes some pretty cool stuff. He really does. And another guy that makes really cool stuff is Chris with Ballistic Dummy Lab. He brought basically an army of hands and torsos, the full body. Yeah. It just really added to what this was. He's working on his YouTube, so go check out his YouTube. That'll be in the description. He's also over on TikTok and he posts videos from everybody that sends him submissions of what they do. So go check all that stuff out. We'll try to link that too. So again, thanks to those two people and back to some really cool high speed. Oh my goodness. <gasps> that fireball is tremendous. Yeah, yeah. yeah BETN has a nice fireball. Look at their faces. It's like when a nuclear bomb goes off in the distance. <laughs> the portal to hell is open and they're staring into oh it. Oh God, look at that rapid shockwave. That's so sharp. <laughs> That's so vicious. All right, let's get some more speed involved. You can see it beating into the back of his skull and everything. There's, look at all the BBs. There's so many. Looking at him, he didn't look that no. beat up, but now seeing this, no, nobody's surviving yeah, that. Look his, look, <laughs> watch the left side of his face. Oh, he's dead. He's oh, he's so dead. Oh, he's so he's dead. So dead. <laughs> There's not a chance. <laughs> it's so bright, it flared the other side of the lens. Yep. <laughs> look how sharp that sound wave is. They're mixed in with the plaster, but you can see his chest just get riddled right there. And then if you watch his stomach, that's getting shredded up as well. Wow. We do have another that's a bit closer in on this area. It looks like their photo was taken. <laughs> all right, what enters the frame first? Yep, all those BBs and plasters. Oh yeah, he's done. He's so done. Oh, it ripped off his scalp. <laughs> he says jaw open. It's as if we had like 20 shotguns of birdshot all going yeah. off at the exact same time, plus a massive concussive wave behind it. And it's in the shadows, but his whole stomach is just, look at this. Well then eventually he, he disappears. He really does. I wonder if we see that on here. Cause now we're getting into wood and dirt. Mm -hmm. There's a big chunk. There's oh, his there body. He oh, yeah. he's, he's starting to emerge as well. Snapped off that PVC and everything. He's gone. That wow. was, uh, that was a lot. That's more than I thought, Tread. Yeah. I literally thought it ripped the middle guy in half. It was close. Yeah, it was close. His <laughs> chest was caved in. I think what happened is the, the wave went up on him because I saw his, his whole 
rib cage was gone, so I think it shot his rib cage up and out. Mm. Uh, so and then took his head off with and it. Over, yeah. yeah. Very cool. All right, so uh, well, claymores are scary. Claymores are so much worse than the video games. Yeah. <laughs> Call of Duty, you like run around, yeah. you're like, ka <laughs> But you could take out like a platoon of people if they're close enough. Yeah, you could take out like 20 people with maybe three claymores pretty easily. And people would chain them up yeah, you all chain the them time. Yep. Awesome. Hope you guys liked that video. I think that's the first time a lot of people have seen a proper claymore in ultra slow motion. Yeah, they are quite devastating. They're no video game object, that's for sure. No. We've got probably one more video coming for you guys here at Washington County Machine Guns, and it's gonna step up the game even more. Yeah. We're not gonna say what it is, but <laughs> let's just say we may or may not more than double the amount of explosives, a different type, but it's gonna be disruptive. Neither so, confirm nor deny. Yeah, so go ahead and subscribe, hit the bell notification, because you're wanting to see the next video. It's going to be incredible. Yeah, I'm excited for it. Let's get out of here. Let's do it. Ooh, it's like a bowling ball. Oh god, there's his brain.